You know, why was I criticizing the music of this game? I had no reason to do that. Some of the music of this game is freaking a jam. Like, the music for this area is actually, like, very pleasant. I do like it. Oh, great. A snowver. Great. I just wanted to put up with you. You know, now's actually a good time to test out how far this guy has come. Oh, no, 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 not you, not you, not you, Kakarot. No, 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 not you, not you. Street Shark. We're testing out Street Shark. Not you. Oh, God, you would die. I know that, so I'm not going to put you through that. I know better. Great, the mist is at it again. Just what I was hoping would happen. Now, that means much to me, but I'm going to kill you anyway. Ow! So I do want to get Riolos of experience. Plus, I want to see how good a flamethrower is. Burn, bitch, burn! Anyway, I need to get out of this icy tundra. Welcome back, everybody, to Wide Play Pokemon Pearl version. This is your host, MJ406. It looks like you are coming along very nicely. And I want to get Kakarot's level up higher. Because I must, for science. Oh, crap, I didn't think I'd run into another one already. I should try to run into the trainer, believe it or not. Ooh! If you do not avoid this, you are dead. That's the last thing I would want. Unfortunately, it's a gamble I gotta go with. So it's either you die, or I catch this. I'm gonna go with the least safe gamble and try to catch it. And well, it's gonna be my ass on the line if I fail. Oh, thank you, high effectiveness of Quick Ball. Oh, thank you, sweet Jesus. I needed that. Well, let's see what we got on the Pokedex here. It's Sneasel the Sharp Claw Pokemon. It is extremely vicious and will not stop attacking until its foe is incapable of moving. Good lord! Jeez, I guess you just want to play dead around one of those things. That is frightening. What persistence. I always battle for keeps. This is no drill. These are battle drills we can do? Since when has there been a thing of like a battle drill? Prepping for being encountered in a battle by some random asshole. Oh, right. It just happens. There's no drill for it. You're just expected to get fucked. Well, whatever. Let's go, bitch. I'll show you what I'm capable of. All right, then. It's time to get somebody else up to snuff. Time to battle you out. I'm going to get Riolu's level up by one and see if he evolves. If not, we'll keep slowly working at it. So I do want to get him to evolve rather soon. His friendship level should be high enough or at least close. I've got the Soothe Bell on him all this time. I'm hoping he finally gets there sooner or later. Because I finally want to start training him so we can learn some really good moves. I really hope I can soon. Move, Mr. Mime! No, it's time for you to try to stop me with your fake hand gestures. Fake? Yes. Also, your mime. You shouldn't talk. Why do I even bother? There we go, level 14! Oh, yeah, you didn't get a lot of experience in the unknown because I didn't let you battle anything. Sorry. Again, you were two points away from leveling up. I didn't want to level up off screen, so. Ow! I didn't bother. Sneasel. Well, the one of the fighting type move. Now, technically, you do know a fighting type move. Force Palm. But you're not nearly strong enough to put up with that thing. Jeez, I should think before I act. Although, it is also ice. Go, Gabite! As long as it doesn't know an ice move, you're okay. I have confidence that you will survive just fine. So please, have confidence in my abilities as a trainer. I have confidence in your survival. That's all I can do at this point. Have confidence that you will survive. Ack, I forgot how fast Sneasel is. That's a, one of its greatest attributes, but that means its defenses suck. Burn, bitch, burn. Ah, you dark and ice little thing. I don't know why. I keep thinking of its name. It's supposed to be like a weasel. I don't know. It's a sneaky weasel. Sneasel. I don't know. Stop thinking about it. Oh, no! Ah! Ice move! Well. That sucks. I'm sorry, Street Shark. You didn't deserve that. You are fighting an ice type. What did you think was going to happen? You... Dumbass! God, why did I think I'd be safe? 
<laughs> I should have known better. Well, you got a level up out of it, so worth it? Not really. Oh, you're getting there. You're getting stronger. Slowly. Won't be at your best until you fully evolve. Well, I don't think that will actually happen until I want to say level 45. Oh, God, still nearly dead. Okay, we only have one Pokemon who can deal with that, so let's just bring him out now. Go, Flap, you do work. I need to get three sharks level higher. Oh, man. I am not going to be ready for the next gym. I mean, I do have a backup plan because of freaking, um, Flap you, but even still, I do not have enough to be prepared for that gym. Most of my Pokemon are actually very unfortunate against ice types. Freaking Staraptor will get hurt. Torterra will get hurt. Gabite will greatly get hurt. And, well, my only real Pokemon who could really do damage to it is still a weak bitch. Ow, the hail! Why well, I think flying was a good idea. At least it doesn't interrupt flight. Thank God. That would have sucked if it interrupted fly. I would have hated that. Oh, man, imagine two turn moons just being interrupted by something else. That would be the worst. I think you never want to use a two turn move again. As soon as you use something to hit you, you don't ever want to use it. Good job. That was an excellent battle. Make them less, a lot less useful. You don't play for keeps. You'll lose, you lose battles you should be dominating. You want to dominate them. I see. Well, because Kabite's nearly dead, I'm going to go heal. Thanks for letting me use the bed, everybody. I appreciate it. Because I desperately need it for my wimpy ass. Oh, Riolu, come on! Evolve already, you fuck! I've been letting you tail with me for so long, I've been hoping your friendship would go up high enough. But clearly, I've overestimated your growth. Oh, God! This cold is but nothing compared to the fire that burns in my heart! Dude, I can't see anything! Gee, as soon as I talked to him, the snow just picked up tremendously. At least it's not heavy hail. Well! Hey, goodbye, you're useful! Because they will primarily use electric moves. Yes, yeah, we get experience for Riolu anyway. Kakarot, watch and learn, you stupid bum! I could also technically use, um, Torterra, but... Well, you need training. Oh, come on! I was hoping you wouldn't do that. I should have known better, and yet I didn't. So now I am the fool, expecting you to make my journey easier. I should have known better. So, let's do what I always do. Try to avoid what I can and give you the most damage. It'd be great if you kept doing electric types, honestly. I would love to keep digging at you. At least nobody here is really trying to protect themselves from ice, except for the one person who had a Sneasel. Crazy, of all the other... Of all the abilities, we have sand to protect from sandstorms. I don't think anybody has an ability to protect themselves from hail. Then again, if you want to do that, you just have an ice type. Hail's a lot more specific. Jeez, that number. And I guess it's just how it is. Ow! At least it doesn't hurt dragon and, or ground types more because of that. Hippopotus again, eh? Alright, lifeguard. Your turn! That's a ground type. I know you can deal with it because you're better than that. Now finish it off! Tiny little hippo. She brought an electric and a ground type to a freaking blizzard. Oh my god! I forgot you have Sandstream. Well, now Gvite can't be hurt. That is a good thing about the outside weather. You can't overwrite the weather conditions. And I want to say if you do that and your weather condition stops, then you don't need to worry about the weather anymore. I don't think it'll like rewrite back to the uh, the outside weather. Great, now I'm hurt by Sandstorm. God damn it, Darude. Always coming when I least want you to, which is always... How rude. All right, anyway. You want to shock that bird? At least you're not bringing out anything like I did that had a quad weakness to ice. Well, if you had a, if you had a grounded flying, I would be very disappointed in you. But by the way, I should imagine since I was thinking about some of the evolutions. Some of the new evolutions you have, 
the crazy thing is you won't actually see a lot of them until post game it's really weird there may be some items that i may get you may be like what the hell is that it's revolving pokemon that um have strange evolutions it's kind of annoying your heart burns as hot as mine that is weird i don't want it to the weather clears up sometimes the view is breathtaking then well good i would hope it would be can't freaking see anything hey hey you think you can defog no oh i thought i'd clear the weather oh man i can't see anything so hard to see a goddamn thing out here i don't know what anything is it's so goddamn cold there's no time to ride around a bike in the snow damn it here i thought it'd be the perfect time to ride around in the snow on a bike Christ. It's so deep. Yeah. More things about me being annoyed about the game's pacing. <laughs> oh, gee, geez, I had drummed into me at ski school. You have a school for skiing? Actually, I shouldn't be surprised by that. So, you can probably imagine. Skiers have ice Pokemon. So, if you didn't expect that, you're nuts. Well... At least my frickin' Gabite should be able to easily kill that thing without much problem. Alright, Gabite. Street Shark. Go do your work. Breathe fire on him. There's no way you can hit him with a hockey stick. That would be wild. <laughs> Just pull a fucking hockey stick out of thin air. Just friggin' start beating the shit out of him. This is my form of slash. It's a penalty. Ow! Why are you tagging me with a giant stick? Aren't you a dragon type? Eh, I prefer to do things the fun way. And you use the ice form of quick attack. I'm so sorry, Gabite. You're probably dead. I'm sorry. Oh, you survived. My man. Learn to beat the odds. God damn you having ice shard. Go screw yourself. Freaking ice shard. Oh. Suck. All right, please level up already and evolve. Faint. Not that useful, but more useful than counter. It only does 50 damage. An attack that hits a foe using protective detect. It also lifts the effect of those moves. So it's also useful in a uh, double battle. So if one of the opposing Pokemon you know is going to use protective detect, and you use that. If Faint can go first, then it can friggin' throw things off. For them trying to do that. Oh. That's a good move to have. You know somebody would do that. It's not worth it. Because they are going to die. Hmm. Ice and grass. Let me gamble on something here. Because this might work out. As weird as it sounds. I think ice moves might work well here. I don't think I ever tried ice on ice. I don't know if it actually kind of uh, detracts from its power or not. Let's try it out. And? Oh, okay, it does. Well, I thought I'd try anyway. You never know. You're gonna waste my time with your goddamn end grain again. Uh, I wanna scream. I wanna scream. It's gonna take so long. I don't even know where I am anymore. You're wasting my time. Seriously! Oh, God! Looks like I'm gonna have to start using my potions. Because I don't trust I'll be able to survive. Well, how about some some of that, eh? Alright, so ice is not very effective against ice. Well, now I know! I'll try to keep that in mind. I figured it wouldn't work, but I thought I'd try anyway in case I'd be surprised. You'd be surprised at how some types work against others, or how they don't work against others. It's worth experimenting if you don't if you don't have them all memorized, which I don't. Because why would I memorize them? Why would I ever do that? Wait, why did I... God damn it. It's still grass, so electric won't be that good. Damn it. Oh, I should have brought a flap you. I should have known better. Why do I keep torturing my Pokemon like this? Oh, yeah, missed up stat reductions. Right, 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 right. 
Well, this won't reduce your defense, but it'll still hurt. You're probably better to use my electric type moves right now. Oh no! Why do you only do that to Lux Ray? It's like you think he only does physical moves. Damn Swagger! Oh, I hate Swagger so much. Oh, well, you'll find it to see if I actually hit myself in confusion for this. You'll see why I hate Swagger. So, oh no! The pain! Look at that! Knocked out 31 health with one hit in confusion. That's why Swagger is annoying. Man, if only they didn't have Ice Shard, I'd be willing to use Gabite on him. But now I don't know if he'll be able to survive it, so I don't want to bother. Oh, come on! Just hit him one more time, damn it! Oh, man, he's gonna kill himself. <laughs> Stop wasting my time! Oh, my God, I am furious. Oh, I freaking hate you. Yep, just go ahead and absorb your nutrients from the ice cream. How do you absorb things in the soil? How do you even reach with all this thick snow on the ground? Oh, you're a dick. This is exactly why I can't bring out Kabite. This is exactly why I can't do it. The fact that he's one of my best options I have fight ice types is stupid. Yep, saw that coming. Every time it hit itself a confusion. Swagger, I hate you. It's not like it increases the amount of times you hit yourself during confusion. That's not how it works. It's a status condition, so you gotta freaking just hope that things work out. But no, I got hit every goddamn time because of course. Oh, that's frustrating. All right then. How about I beat the shit out of you? Can't believe you killed my snarf. Well, at least I have revives. I think I still have some potions left. I don't want to use any max potions or anything like that. Keep those become useful. But anything less than that, I will use. Will your speed go up? Yes. And you level up again. Your attack is rising. Oh, God, the hail. There's still one more. Dude, this battle's taking way too long. Finally. Oh. Well, since Narva is dead. Go, Raphael. Hit them with Razor Leaf. Now that you have Miracle Seed, you can probably kill it in one hit. Finally, a non-ice type. I've been waiting for this all match. Now get out of my way, please. I'm so glad I don't have to rely on Quick Claw anymore. Ugh, Earthquake is still the strongest attack, but a super effective hit from Razor Leaf will still do better, especially if it lands critically. I gotta hope I get you a good Grass move, because Wood Hammer is not the one I want. For competitive play, sure, but for casual play through the game, no. I don't believe it. My techniques were rebuffed. Good, because you freaking kicked my ass. I should have been rolling a book on trainer school. Well, dude, you you did good enough. Believe me when I say you did well enough. God damn. Oh, wait, Matt. MJ, you gotta go to the medicine. Stop using your name. Okay, let's see. Well, I have plenty of... I have one super potion. I have two hyper potions. I have one max revive. I don't want to use that, though. Come back, Snarf! It's good to see you. Fully healed and healthy. Not fully healed, but you're healthy, at least. One super potion. I will use that on you, Street Shark. Hopefully you don't get caught off guard like that again. Also, freaking... He didn't level up again. God damn you, Kakarot. Also, I hate that every time you use an item, you gotta go back to the menu. That is a convenience that the next generation improves on greatly. If you're using an item, it can keep letting you repeatedly using the item until you don't need it anymore. Like, you don't have to leave the menu of the Pokemon you have up there until you're done using it. Ugh. But no, I gotta enter in and out every goddamn time. You are bothering me, man. Just for that, you're waiting a good, good while to freaking level up again. <sighs> I just have to run around with him more. He's close, though. He's definitely close. I know that for a fact. Oh, my God! Let me out of the snow, please! I see an item in there. 
Give it. Iron. You know, I can always just try to increase his stats. That's a thought. Also, I want to see what is near her over there. Because it's surrounded by trees. Oh my god, why is the snow so thick? This blizzard sucks, man. This blizzard sucks. Oh, it's another skier. Shit. Rainy days make me feel blue, but the incidents aren't as snow. I'm as happy as can be. Because you figured out a way to travel. And always a way I could wear skis. But no. I never get that kind of luxury. I would never be prepared for that. Oh, yeah. And the, uh, the color of the middle stripe determines its gender. Just so you know. It's brown if it's male. It's white if it's female. I do, do, I do like those visual distinctions. Burn, bitch, burn! Oh, yes, finally, I can kill you! Oh, my God, what am I going to get out of this snow? Oh, this is one of the worst environments to walk through in the game. And we haven't gone to the depths of Mount Coronet yet. Oh, excuse me. That's where it's going to be worse. Guess it's weren't very good. Yeah, especially when you have a firestorm raining on you, bitch. Can you boy use a hidden move to climb cliffs? Uh, we'll get there when we get there. Damn it. I was hoping there was a hidden item here. I was wrong. Ugh. I hate how you can't tell where the depth of the snow is. So! Wait, what is that? Oh god, why are you walking to you? Poof! You got a good ice buddy, me! Damn it! No, why? Oh! Oh, that was a mistake I am going to regret making. And you keep. A god. Damn Zubat here! Why? Why would you ever want a Zubat here in the ice? Well, Dragon Claw type, bitch! This is what you get for bringing a Zubat out here. I hope you'll regret your decisions. Damn, that Dragon Claw is useful. It's not even the best Dragon type move I can give him. But it's a good one either way. Oh, you'll be okay. Don't worry about it. That, on the other hand, might be a different story. All right, Snarf. Time for you to make a comeback. I have confidence you'll be able to kick this one's ass. Through Spark or Thunderbolt. I know you'll be able to win in one turn. Now show me why you're one of my reliables. It's weird that he hasn't been extremely reliable as I've wanted him to be. Probably because the electricity doesn't work as well as I expect. I expect the paralysis to kick in more. But then again, I'm more expecting one hit kills of these. There we go! Show your freaking ace status once again. Good job, Snarf. Summon your power and use it accordingly. Exactly what I want out of you. So who's next? Ow! Is another Zubat? Ah, Krogunk. You know what? Yeah, keep going. I want you to be able to get your experience so I can stop needing to level you up. I want you to catch up. Then don't worry about catching up Riolu. Soon enough, he'll be ready to evolve, which I'm hoping, after I'm done training you, he will be. Once he evolves, I'll be training him a fuck ton. That's the only reason I'm still training you now. Because he's unable to evolve yet. I thought I ran out, but I was wrong. What is he doing? I'm gonna do something evil. Because of that, my special attack is really good now. What do you have, freaking gunk shot or? No, I think you're looking for the term sludge bomb. Which by the way, that's a TM I don't think I'll be able to get. I would like to have sludge bomb though. Actually, I guess I could get it. I just don't remember where. Eh, not important. All that matters is that you're done for. You stupid freaking pro gunk. All you guys have annoying Pokemon is one out of my way. I have no more regular potions or super potions. Yeah, you stay out. You can kill this one, too. I just wish I could freaking heal more. I'll have to remember to pick up some potions and stuff in the, uh, shop. I gotta remember to buy more healing items. I am having a lot of, you know... Eh. What was I gonna say? Oh, yeah. I'm getting a lot of money now. You mean, oh, 
those are my weak spots. So I'm good at healing items. I got a lot I can buy. So I should do it. I'll play my Pokemon even a blizzard. Good. I'm glad you appreciate torturing your Pokemon in this kind of harsh environment. I hate this snow. Let me out. Let me out for the love of God. I do not want to be in here anymore. Ooh, an item. Oh, cool. Hey, you want to do this all the time? No. Is that another building? Let me in, please. Help! Help! Well, I was probably my way to the blizzard dropping each hip. If I saw the hidden move rock, I'd be able to scale sheer cliffs. I hope you're not telling me I have to find it out in the blizzard. Oh, it's probably right outside the house. Not going there. I want to get to the next town over. I want to be able to have a proper Pokemon Center rest at. Rock climb! All right. Good. Once I get to the next town over, I'm gonna go to the Pokemon Center, heal. I'm gonna do. I'm gonna do what I want to do to teach the proper Pokemon rock climb. Which, by the way, is there something over here? <laughs> no. 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 I'll battle the rest of you later. God. There's still people everywhere. They're everywhere. I need help. Person. A rare sight. Thank you for visiting. A gift. Spell tag! Increase the power of ghost type moves. The spell tag intensifies ghost type moves. They serve you well. At least I have rock climb. Alright, excuse me. Oh, I just want to get around the house. Come on. Oh no, I went the wrong way. By the way, we this. A boulder's across with ice. It's bone chilling to touch. So yeah, there's an ice rock there. You may think that thing is useless because it's just an ice rock. Beware! And here's another thing this game introduced! Here's a thing that we probably won't get to go over unless I actually see one of those Pokemon. Oh god. Run! Run before he sees you! Hurry! 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 Lake of Cutie. We're close. Do I have to cut through the lake? Oh shit! No! I thought I could make it! What is it? The Pokemon Battle? Yes! I just want to get to that town, please! Let me get to the town for the love of God! I do not want to be out here any longer than I have to! See, this sucks! I freaking hate this environment! It's goddamn hail! Why wouldn't you hate this freaking environment? Now, if you'll excuse me, I want to get out of here! So move! I will burn all your petals off, bitch! Move your ass! Out of my way. Oh, wow. That didn't work as well as I thought it would. <laughs> oh, come on. I gotta counteract the hail. Oh, my God. I freaking hate this. I hate it so much. I just want it to end. I don't... I don't care anymore. Just freaking get everybody out of my goddamn way. Oh, I want to get to that town and save. I am done with this shit. I am done with this shit. I'm not putting up with you anymore! Oh my god, who thought this environment was a good idea? I can't see anything, I don't know where I'm going, I keep getting slowed down by the goddamn snow, trainers are everywhere trying to slow me down even more, and there's not any good healing place in sight after the start of it. So you have to have to trek your whole way down, and I swear, if I have to go through the lake before I get to that next town, I am going to be pissed. <sighs> Okay, I got that out. I feel a little better. Now, let's just try to get rid of this trainer and hope that I can make calmly make my way over. I hope I can. I don't really want to end this episode until I'm somewhere safe. If I see I have to deal with plot, I'm going to stop the episode. But otherwise, I want to get to the town and then I'll end it when I finally get there. So how about you let me move on so I can get to that town? Oh, God, this environment is the worst. I hate this place. I absolutely hate it. I want it to die in a fire. Also, I forgot to go to Veilstone and freaking massage freaking Rio. That would have helped. Ooh, you are alive, aren't you? Somehow, yes. Around these parts, perhaps, because of all the snow, there are many folktales of hauntings. People have died running through here, I'd imagine. <laughs> Jeez, that's really dark. I'm sorry, I hate this place! I'm gonna do this so I can keep them off me. 
Security Lakefront. Well, at least I finally calmed down. Oh god, how strong is that that I got it thrown into an encounter? Oh dear. Oh, level 36. You're exactly his level. I just want to cut through and get to the town if you don't mind. I hope I'm not blocked off or I'm going to be pissed. Please leave me alone, sir. I don't have time to... Oh my god! Let me just look at a map real quick. Look, I want to find this town. Alright. Yes, Snow Point is all the way over to the right. Alright, I want to get to Snow Point as quickly as I can. Ooh, an item! Don't mind if I do. I'll take that because I wasted one on a Snowbird I didn't even catch with it. Let's hurry. Snow Point, it's gotta be this way. Yes, I see it! The town! Snow Point City, City of Snow. Oh, thank God! Finally! Also, here's the gym. Snow Point City Gym, Leader Candace, the Diamond Dust Girl. You could probably guess that this gym is an ice gym. And you'd be right! Oh, thank God! You know what? Let me go and heal in person just so you guys see it. Oh, thank God I made it out! You know how there are many ice type Pokemon around Snow Point City? I wonder if they also live in the temple. Oh, there's a temple here. We won't be able to go over that for um, <coughs> reasons. I'll go over that as soon as I am, um, uh. Yeah, get to it in a later episode. But good news! We made it to another city! I have things I'm gonna wanna do before we start next episode, but that'll be for then. Sound, sound gets swallowed up by the snow. That's why it's very quiet here. Yeah, I bet it is. Who would ever want to live in a town like this? It's isolated from everything. It's so goddamn cold and awful. I'd hate it here. I already do. Oh, pray the sun god. Make all this place fucking melt, please. Melt the whole town down in fire. Take it down in a blaze of glory. All right, well, let's end this episode. All right. We finally made it to Snowport City. Good. Now I can relax. So come back next time. I'm probably going to go to a shop. And I got some other little things I need to do. So just getting real uh, freaking massage. Maybe I'll do it on my own time. But next time, we're going to go back to that blizzard and either deal with the lake there or try to go back and hunt down the rest of the trainers I missed. It's a pain in the ass, but it's got to be done. <laughs>